Hello everyone, welcome to our YouTube channel Vlogs with Kirat. Uh, I feel so happy today because I'm making a video after so long. It's been uh, more than 8 days that I did not interact with my uh, subscribers, with my friends, with my YouTube fam. So I'm feeling good. I always feel good when I make a video. And this video gonna be in English because uh, some international students, um, they are going to get uh, admission in uh, Okanagan College and they were asking me if I can make a video in English so that they can understand that how are the jobs in Kelowna, what, what types of jobs are available, how is the Kelowna city and they were not from India, they were from a different country and that's why they want me to make one video for them so that's what I am doing right now. So let's start the video. And one good news I want to share with you guys that our channel gonna hit 10k soon it's gonna it's like now it is more than 9700 subscribers so it's gonna hit 10k soon and i'm so happy because it give me little appreciation for what i'm doing because if you're getting some views if you're getting some likes co comments subscribes then you always feel good yeah then you feel like you're going in the right direction and uh, i feel so appreciated and thank you so much everyone for subscribing my channel and one thing more i want to add in my video before i start my topic of the day uh, so english is not my first language my first language is Punjabi so if I do some mistakes please uh, highlight them and put it in the comments so that I will I can improve myself so let's start the video okay so Kelowna is a beautiful city and Kelowna is a tourist place basically and Kelowna is like five hours uh, far from Vancouver and, um, it's like uh, nearby 346 kilometers far from uh, sorry Vancouver area there's a lots of snow as compared to Vancouver in uh, winters and uh, the good thing about the city is uh, like the structure it's a beautiful everywhere you go you will find uh, like beautiful beach beautiful sceneries and beautiful lakes here and everywhere you go every corner it's like a so beautiful city that's why it's little expensive and to find a rental place it's pretty expensive as i just mentioned you that it's a tourist place so for sure there are lots of uh, food businesses here because when tourists uh, come here in Kelowna in summers they always uh, eat outside most of them like you know take our example when we go out somewhere we always eat out most of the time right so that's why there are lots of uh, food businesses and they get super busy in the summer time because in the summer time most of the tourists come here and uh, they enjoy at the beach at the lake and different places to do so much fun in uh, summer but as comparison to winter time it's way too slow I would say almost uh, dead in the downtown because in the morning if you go you will not find anyone or in the evening there are very less people um, unless it's a weekend or something right top businesses here are like uh, wineries uh, food places uh, and grocery stores and uh, like a uh, few sunripe uh, and so many places here but I'll give you one trick to find a job if you're new to Kelowna. If you're new to Kelowna as an international student and you don't know anything about uh, where to get the jobs and you're so confused where to apply, where to distribute your resumes and uh, if you applied lots of jobs on Indeed already and you're not getting any, then I'll tell you the trick what you need to do. So I big chains that that's in my mind right now and I'm gonna tell you about that and uh, first of all it's like uh, and jobs that I'm gonna talk about that's like entry-level jobs a student you can work on part-time over there or if you if you're getting 30 hours you know in the starting that's not too bad so it's 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 gonna be more like starting jobs entry-level jobs so it's gonna be first thing is Tim Hortons there are lots of Tim Hortons franchises here in Kelowna it's like almost everywhere in Canada but in Kelowna there are lots of Tim Hortons and there are McDonald's too there are Burger King too and the fourth thing there are so many grocery stores too and so many pizza stores too so to get the job according to me it's uh, very easy right now because when i came in 2017 it was extremely hard for me to get the job and the good thing is that like i have lots of experience now because uh, 
in the two years of my study i changed seven jobs i did like seven different jobs i think more than seven i don't remember now but i did more than seven different jobs so that's why i do have little experience that how to get the jobs so first of all let's say if you're new to kelowna and you're struggling for the jo job and you if you're struggling for the job and it's getting hard for you to get the job so what do you need to do so first thing you just need to make you just need to make your resume a good one a good resume in which you can add the experience anything you did before even the voluntary work in your uh, previous country any volunteer work you did just put it on your resume and try to make it a very simple not make it complex or not not mention any fake experience and not mention so many jobs on your resume so what you need to do just make your resume put your email over there put your address over there oh sorry not address put your phone number over there so that employer can contact you and all these things and put your availability over there and if you want to get the full-time job because students can do now more than 20 hours per week so if you want to get the full-time job then try to put all the days on which you are free and then they can give you the job according to that so what do you need to do and after that just print the resume like make 20 to 30 copies of your resume then distribute trick like very easy to get the jobs you know that like there are so many tim hortons just print your resumes and distribute your resume to every single tim hortons so then the probability will go that much high if it is here like you're applying on the indeed and you know you're not getting any job if you distribute your resume at uh, by going personally over there and put their resume if there's any job available please uh, let me know you can tell their manager then your probability will go over there from here so that's the things that's the best trick to find the job in Kelowna if you're struggling for the job Tim Hortons and then you know do the same thing for the McDonald's do the same thing for the Burger King do the same thing for grocery stores because in the starting you just want to get the experience you just want to start anything that can make you money so that you can pay your bills everything is getting expensive in Canada everything is getting expensive in Canada trust me and apply this technique you will definitely get success in that 101 percent sure that this trick gonna work like i tried this technique seven times it's not even like uh, one time two time three times i tried the same technique seven times and every single time i was able to get the new job yeah so this technique is 101 percent verified by blogs with kirat guy and uh, yeah it's verified by me and other thing I just want to add up so many other things in this video you know like uh, if you want to work uh, in a liquor store then if you want to work in a liquor store then you have to make a liquor license if you want me to describe about it then I can definitely describe about the license how to get one and if you give your resume over there they're not gonna accept it they will accept it but they will not hire you because uh, most of them they prefer that if you already have license then it's gonna be easier for you to get the job in the liquor store if you like dri driving then there are lots of uh, delivery places uh, where you can deliver the pizzas and uh, so many other things right one thing i just want to describe you guys so one guy he asked me question that what experience he should get in india to get the job here and he was asking me is there more carpentry or is there more you know any food experience that he need to uh, work that he can do in india so i told him that there's a, always a training process even for these jobs too like tim hortons there's a, always training for two weeks or three weeks then after training then you go on the floor and then you serve uh, the customers or there's nothing you need to be learn about before or you have to you know like if because in the starting i was thinking i don't my first job was tim hortons uh, my first job was in tim hortons and i was a little worried and you know nervous i was like i don't know anything about steep tea i don't know anything about coffee i don't know anything about bagels or how many how many types of bagels are there i was so worried but they trained me so well and they always tell you every single thing like in a very good manner that you can uh, grab the training it gets very easier for you to get everything you know every training and then you will be after working a while you will 
you will get more experience in that thing and it will be getting easier in the future there are so many other types of jobs are available too but uh, i just wanted to talk about the entry level jobs which yeah so that's what i wanted to share with you guys and uh, i hope everyone gets my point that how they can increase the probability at very high rate by distributing uh, their resume to every single place by going in person and then they can easily get the jobs and they can start paying their bills i hope that will work for you guys and uh, almost four to five uh, people who texted me on uh, insta that they are not getting jobs that i hope they will get the jobs to always you know keep checking on the facebook groups facebook uh, like jobs in kelowna try to search in uh, uh, whatsapp try to try to search the whatsapp groups try to make your network try to ask people try to talk by doing this you will definitely get success and best of luck everyone and if you're new to canada then welcome to canada and one thing i just want to talk about like i was in the line in tim hortons and then there was uh, one guy he was from punjab too like from the same state where i belong to and he came to me and and he said yeah you helped me on insta and i was like feeling so happy after that i was uh, so happy for him you know like i was happy that my videos are helping you guys so thank you so much and like my video and do comment if you need uh, any other information about anything i'll try to help you uh, as much as i can and please let us know if you watch this video and uh, you apply this trick and if it will work for you then please let us know in the comments so that other people can get more information about that too and thank you so much everyone for giving me your precious time and i see you guys in next vlog and that i'm gonna make maybe tomorrow or maybe day after tomorrow i don't know when i'm gonna make it but for sure video is gonna come regularly and i always try my best to put the video on my youtube channel but you know sometime i'm a little busy but i'll try my best and thank you so much for watching my video have a good day stay safe stay happy same logo every time stay safe stay happy because it is the best logo take care